LKD loop revisited 2022 fall foliage edition. back there. So they have a mulching operation going on. Super nice guy to let me go through. I was not expecting that, but in the clear and I'm gonna continue on. Feels very damp out here today. Had about a little over three inches of rain in 24 hours. Rare warm up that I wanted to take advantage of and be able to wear short sleeves and shorts and also get the Joey pack out for one more trip. Probably one of the last ones I'll be able to do for this year with this pack before I start using the V2 and my Hyperlite Southwest pack. For the winter time feels great being out here again now really looking forward to seeing this whole loop through again despite the huge amount of rain yesterday this whole ridge that i'm approaching now on the new england trail is pretty dry i currently have two liters of water and about 13 or 14 miles to go to camp the camp i'm staying at tonight does have a water cache so hopefully there will be some water in there. If I do need water, if I go a little bit more north on the New England Trail, there's a park about a couple of miles away from camp where hopefully fill up water. But there's no guarantee if the water fountains are on there. So I'm just gonna play it by ear and we'll see how it goes. I haven't done this whole loop in the fall yet, so it'll be another one to check off the list. is that flat spot that I shared in past trip videos. Everything's just a little damp right now, but easily passable. Off in the distance is the Hanging Hills and Meriden on the New England Trail. And then over there we have the Hubeline Tower section rocks. <laughs> There's a 
huge owl up ahead here. That was pretty cool. Beautiful owl. Probably looking for some dinner. I'm right there with him. I can't wait for dinner. Grab some pizza from town. It's gonna be a nice reward at the end of the day. For my fellow AT hikers, doesn't this remind you of the Dover Oak? Always a highlight on this trail. It definitely reminds me of that tree. What a great day today, but I am beat. I'm gonna finish getting cleaned up here at camp, get some shut eye, and I'll see you all in the morning. Good morning. Got some beautiful foliage over here behind me. Perfect conditions again for hiking today. Water was a little low at camp, so I'm gonna stop right over here, I think, and get some water. Here I am, rock you like a hurricane. We will, we will rock you. I want to rock, rock. I want to rock, rock. One, two, three o'clock, four o'clock, rock. I want to rock and roll all night and party every day for those about to rock. We salute you. I love rock and roll. Let's put another dime in the jukebox, baby. 
I love rock and roll. Keep on rocking in the free world. Keep on rocking in the free world. I want you to rock the boat. Rock the boat. Rock the boat. Rock the boat. I know it's only rock and roll, but I like it. I know it's only rock and roll, but I like it. Like it. Yes, I do. Holy rocks. I forgot all about that section. That was a nice little scramble. Wow. Check that out. That is fantastic. And off in the distance, right above my finger, is Mount Tom in Massachusetts on the New England National Scenic Trail. And then way, way off in the distance, you can see the Seven Sisters just past Mount Tom to the right. Let's see if I can get that into view. It's a little foggy over there, but you can see them a little bit. Then you hit Mount Norvatuck right there in the center. And then continue north up to New Hampshire. Perfect compliment to this trip and the fall pumpkin season. I'm gonna compliment that even further. Some Pumpkin fig bars. What an incredible trip. Felt great getting out under the tarp again. Felt great using the Joey pack again for what could be the last trip of the year before I start using my colder weather packs. A lot of fall foliage on this trip, a lot of wildlife. I hope you all enjoyed this video as much as I did putting it together and getting out there on the trail. If you did, hit the like button and consider subscribing to this channel. Thank you for watching and thank you for subscribing. Get out there yourself and get out on the trails. And until then, catch you in the next one.